What's happening guys and welcome to this week's episode of Meals with Marty where we're going to make one of my all time favourite go to snacks. There's no bacon, no setting, no cooking, nothing needed. Literally 5 minutes from right now till the bowl and ready to eat. We're going to make some quick yogurt, we're going to top it with some fruit, top it with some granola, then top it with some chocolate as well. Obviously, so let's get rocking, let's get this made. So then guys you'll need some Greek yogurt, I'm using the 0% fat one, a big bowl, some strawberries, some blueberries, and some grapes. You will also need some granola of your choice. At the minute, I'm using this one. It's the Kellogg's coconut, cashew, and almond one. You will also only need one of these, so choose whatever one you like. I am a chocoholic, so fiber one, chocolate fudge brownie, fiber one, triple chocolate cake bars, or 90% dark chocolate cocoa. Today, I'm going to use this, but I can also crumble one of these over the top at the end. So let's get all of this into this. When I say this is one of my all time favorite go to meals or snacks to have, I really did mean it, I would eat this like every single day in my club. Sometimes I do. So guys, first things first, we will take our washed, of course, strawberries, and we will chop them. There you go. We will also take a square of our dark chocolate, and we will just shred with the edge of the After that, we will get some Greek yogurt into our bowl. I use 250 grams of this. 250 grams are half a regular size pot. After that, we're going to wash a handful of our blueberries and our grapes. Dump them all. Up next, strawberries onto this. Second last, bit of granola. And lastly, our dark chocolate, just sprinkled over the entire thing. And there we have our Greek yogurt and granola bowl, topped with strawberries, blueberries, grapes, and of course, dark chocolate. How good does that look? So good you can't even see the Greek yogurt anymore. So then guys, there it is, I told you it was quick and easy. That took me five minutes, if even, and I also recorded it for the camera. And look at how quick we have an amazing, tasty, nutritious little bowl of goodness ready to eat. As long as I have fresh fruit in the house, I will eat that every single day. Sometimes I actually enjoy like looking forward to it, like it's so sweet and so nice. It is like a treat as well. But yeah, honestly, that is my number one go-to snack meal right there in that bowl. The only thing I do change sometimes is the topping. So instead of 90% dark chocolate, I will use either this little cake bar crumbled over or the little brownie fiber one bar crumbled over. They're only 90 calories, so they are insane taste for all the calories that you put into that. But don't be afraid to get creative with what you crumble over the top of it. You can literally top this with anything. I just am a big chocoholic, so I love chocolate. If you do have any nice toppings, be sure to drop them in the comments below to let me know so that I can give them a try. Because I'm all up for this bad boy, 24-7. But there you guys, that is this week's Meals for Morning. I told you it'd be simple, it'd be quick, and it'd be something you can eat every single day at home, helping towards your favorite day, while keeping the sweet tooth at bay. So hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this week's episode. If you did, let me know in the comments below. Hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next one next week. <laughs>